Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. It's Eva from Bohemian Crafting and today I'm coming to share with you those two journals. But before I will share these two, uh, I would like to go back a little bit uh, to that previous video where I shared this template. Uh, I somehow was too concentrated on to show you how you can decorate that, uh, that template and totally forgot to tell you uh, the purpose I, I came up with this shape and why I wanted to use it and how you can use it. So uh, we did decorate few of these paper clips in that previous video and I said that it can be like a paper clip and I also forgot to show properly uh, how it actually works. Once you have decorated this shape, this is the template I shared. I will put all links down below for that previous video and also for that free download of this one, uh, of, of, of this template. So uh, I, I, you know, I was like <laughs> very concentrated on <laughs> to show you a few layers and <laughs> on my English and I totally forgot. I am really sorry. So once you decorate that, uh, that shape, the template, I forgot to tell to, to show you closely how you actually slide it on the page. Or how is it work? Why is it holding so nicely? You do have that paper clip around, not inside. So that way, that way, this uh, this shape, it's like extension of your paper clip. And when you wanna see these small ones, that <laughs> just drive me crazy. Once you have it on your <laughs> on your paper, that paper clip, then when you open those two sides, here is one side, one half, and here is other half. So then you going with the page between those two sides, and you're sliding your page between that paper, like here. And I did a, a small video right after I uploaded that previous one and I put link to that description box <clears throat> under the video but I know it was just few people who clicked on that link so I'm coming today to show you how other way you can use it because there uh, I got many questions why I actually punched those two holes so I punched them <clears throat> because uh, I called these page stoppers and that's what was first purpose of this this shape uh, i'm working on this journal by the way these are beautiful papers i received from from maxine thank you maxine they are gorgeous and because these papers are a little bit smaller than my pages here and i wanted to kind of like <clears throat> keep them stopped from from flying that's why page stoppers because here i used only one shape one of these kind of like triangles I cut out one I punch those holes and to those holes I put brats here and it it, it is in that uh, video in that short extension or, or extra video I made but I'm, I'm gonna show it here as well so <clears throat> here I'm using it like a page stopper uh, I glue it here on this side this side is free of glue so you can slide the page behind and here in this journal I'm going to show you how other different way you can uh, you can use it uh, yeah here and why those holes are there maybe you do have some um, few papers you want to put into mini no notepad or mini journal so just put them together put this template around and where there are holes, you can put the brats or sew it uh, with the thread. And you do have mini notepad with a decorative uh, paper clip, which can be uh, with decorative shape, which can be also like a holder for ephemera. So that was an another thing I wanted to use it for. But I was really so concentrating on decorating and to show you another decorating idea. And to make sure I'm, I'm talking kind of like <laughs> not too much. Uh, not See, now I, I confuse myself that I'm saying uh, everything I want to say uh, 
understandable way yeah and i totally forgot i'm so sorry um another way now i forgot what i wanted to say <laughs> oh my oh yeah and then uh, i had few questions why i used two different <clears throat> grammage of paper it does ha have a reason uh, the light paper that normal very cheap paper i think 80 gsm paper that very light one i used uh, because I knew uh, I'm gonna make collage. Uh, I'm gonna use all my scraps and glue them on that paper so that paper will become uh, harder and good for uh, for this shape. And uh, the other one I print out on cardstock uh, because I knew that I'm gonna use just stamps and that brayer and I will don't make any thick layer from the other side. So uh, I need it heavy cardstock because i i knew i will don't glue it on the top uh, you know layers of book pages or or some off cuts so i need heavy cardstock to make sure that my template will be uh, nice and strong and uh, it will be not just from you know from piece of paper like this and when i will fold it it will doesn't hold anything so that's why i choose uh, heavy cardstock for stamping and that brayer technique because it did just very light uh, light coat and for my collaging with scraps I choose that uh, light paper because with all those scraps it became nice and strong cardstock so that was another thing I wanted to tell you <clears throat> and I think that's probably hopefully all there was comment, um, I, I should have a look, I'm gonna have a look, there was one beautiful comment, oh yeah, I found it, from Elizabeth Kerkhoff, I hope I'm saying that right, uh, she made beautiful comment, yes, uh, she, she had <laughs> many of these ideas too, uh, that uh, these, these templates, these shapes, can be used like back toppers, that's a brilliant idea, uh, paper clipper. Uh, book hinges yeah yeah something like this i guess maybe she she meant tab uh tablet toppers tablet toppers page tabs with dangles on it yeah yeah and then that, that, that fastness so that, that's what i do have on my page here so it's good like uh back toppers and book hinges i think uh tablet toppers i'm not sure what that is tablet toppers page tabs yes that's true so this shape it's it's amazing for many different styles so i hope you like that shape and i hope you you will enjoy to work with that shape <laughs> so that's what i wanted to say and now i'm going to share with you those two journals uh, i had through to that time i had many chats and uh, i received many amazing amazing uh, messages from you and i'm always so feeling so blessed because i do have here amazing audience really i can't wish for better audience than i do have right now you are so amazing all of you and you are giving me so much out, uh, ideas and you know inspiration and this is kind of like that idea where I had to stop myself. <laughs> it, was, it was so funny. Usually when I when I'm making, I'm, I'm gonna show you the journal and I'm gonna talk. Usually when I am making some journal, I'm sitting here and I'm thinking how I will decorate it, what I will put here, what I will put there, and sometimes I'm, I'm struggling with that. But this time I was like, oh, you can't put there anything. Don't, don't put there anything. Because these journals, these two journals are made the way where the new owner will decorate it. There is many things and uh, there is many pockets and many openings. But uh, I was kind of like controlling myself. Do not use so many embellishments and try to keep the pages and those openings uh, like uh, that somebody else will continue and will put stamps and 
decorations and maybe washi tapes, maybe laces. You know, somebody else will, will finish that book uh, the way the new owner will like it. So this is, uh, this is like build it yourself. No, build it yourself. <laughs> I don't know how to describe it. This is journal where you will finish it. So it has so many openings. It has so many pockets because I do love to create openings and pockets. It's something very magical to, you know, pull out page and that page will open itself. <laughs> Sometimes I am, I am thinking about myself that I got stuck in my childhood <laughs> because I'm just amazed by all these <laughs> moving parts all these pockets <laughs> so, sometimes i'm thinking about myself that i got stuck in that you know childhood in that ch child thinking because i like to play <laughs> so we do have many pockets many openings even this journal those two journals are not like huge they do have kind of nice space for writing and it also can be at their <coughs> signature because in both of them uh, I created elastic holder. We will get there. So we do have many, many pockets with openings and with ephemeras. There is so many ephemeras. I didn't want to leave it empty. So here we have that elastic band where you can slide some uh, signature. All these large pages, they do have three pockets here, full of ephemeras. And I think this is only page I kind of try to decorate it all. So it's open like this and like this. We do have quotes and we can lift this one up. And we do have small pocket here. So this journal, it's like, <clears throat> finish it yourself. <laughs> and I do have small Polaroid frames. Put their stamps and add their, uh, your notes and messages. Just sit down and enjoy it. When I'm talking about sit down, I have to tell you something. <laughs> My son was laughing so hard when I told him what was happened to me uh, through to that COVID lockdown. <laughs> Stupid COVID. I, I put some weight on. <laughs> I'm not that skinny like I was before, so <laughs> put some weight on. And I do have that office chair, that chair where you can manage the high with that handle under that seat and it's going uh, down and up, you know. I do have that office chair, but because <clears throat> I put a little bit <laughs> weight on, I think I'm a little bit heavier than <laughs> the chair can handle. So lately, when I'm sitting on my chair, uh, my chair, <clears throat> it's getting like poop, 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 and I am nearly on the floor, right? <laughs> So usually I'm trying to just, oh, I'm, I'm sliding down now and I'm laughing. But because I am woman, you know, and every month, you know, <laughs> uh, I do have visit, right? <laughs> like all women, right? <laughs> and before that visit, I'm mostly very moody. Like really very moody. <laughs> so it was right before that visit <laughs> where I was moody and my chair went down with me like poop, poop, poop. And because I was in that, <laughs> in that lovely mood, <laughs> I, <laughs> I stand up and I grab the chair on those handles and I was like, don't do it. <laughs> Like weird, really like very crazy way. And I sat on it like hardly. I shouldn't do that because my chair just broke down. The bottom where are those wheels that was split off from that from that uh, sitting area. That bottom fly away from me and I got stuck 
in my chair in that sitting area and uh, I was like with all my uh, force I mean hands and feet up <laughs> was stuck in that seat and because as I said I took a little bit of weight up I just couldn't get out from that stupid chair I was fighting here <laughs> like you only you could hear but was like sound like you know bull before attack when he's like making <gasps> so funny and i was crying like oh my god because i'm i'm not that sporty <laughs> that athletic lately I'm, I'm like very lazy lately so it took me 10 minutes i had to twist myself on on four in that chair to get out from there <laughs> I was terrible. And when I told to my son, he was laughing and he told me, oh, it's so a shame I was sleeping. <laughs> so we do have few writing areas, some pockets, and these are, and they are, they are in some pockets somewhere, I forgot to show you. These are, um, uh, it is dye cutting dye from uh, planners essentials elizabeth crafts crafts dye i will put link uh, link i will put name including number of these dies down below and i used just embossing folder first i cut out from can uh, i cut out this shape and it's really beautiful it's not proper like it will doesn't hold anything uh, it's like paper clip, but it will doesn't hold anything because it's just, you know, it's just very teeny tiny die. But it will be beautiful decoration on some layout, you know, to glue it somewhere, just like decoration. So it, it's few of them in there. And here we have the last one. And that will be this journal. So I'm having <laughs> these issues lately with my chair. <laughs> It's so terrible. I will have to... Yeah, I... You know, I'm on keto diet now. I'm taking keto diet. The I, I took the book with keto diet. But I think it's a step in the right direction. <laughs> so that is inside. And you should see this one. It's uh, temporarily as well for now. And here is one uh, bigger pocket. Oh, they are there. Those those paper clips. That's the one journal. And there is second one. I'm just gonna close it. So I will have to start to do something <laughs> because the chair just drives me crazy. That it can't hold me anymore. <laughs> so we do have pocket here. We do have um kind of like holder, holder spot, or pen holder spot, so where is it, here, so you can put there your pen, behind this, uh, this paper, or this cardstock, and here we have this opening, <coughs> where you are, come on, so again, opening, and I do have tutorial for something like this uh, on my YouTube. I will try to find the link. It's probably not exactly the same, but it's very similar. This opening. I don't even remember how I made this one, you know. I'm always scoring with some idea in my head. And uh, mostly then I am forgetting the measurement. It's just I'm going to score it somehow. Because I do have some idea in my head. We do have pocket here. And here again some openings and pages and envelopes. And pockets. Loads of pockets. And this journal has also the elastic band here. Pockets with ephemeras and with those uh, slides. And with this mini folder. And here we have, this is also from uh, Elizabeth Crafts Die, <coughs> Planners Essentials. I do love this die so much. Uh, you can put pictures behind and to make some beautiful page with this. I left it open so anything can be glued here and then put it together. And you will have beautiful embellishment. And again, some opening. 
and we have again that beautiful opening <laughs> I do love all these uh, surprising openings and we have uh, yeah, this pocket we did while ago here on YouTube as well it's that multi opening pocket with many with many pockets here is pocket and I do have again ephemera behind this one is here and here we have <coughs> from Tim Holtz I mean uh, with Tim Holtz papers I do have here those two beautiful large pockets and they are actually holding behind that elastic band and I do have opening here with some ephemera inside opening here and here I forgot to put ephemera look at me I will have to have a look what I've got ha and I do have pockets here with some ephemeras and I do have this moving part here so you can write something here something here and then just close it and we have pocket here just a tuck spot we do have pocket here large space and and one more I need something I need something to slide it behind come here so we do have kind of like a slide spot here so this is this journal both will be for sale <clears throat> I will put links down below and this one has pocket uh, in the back as well and I need to find my second uh, envelope I do have this uh, fabric envelope see <laughs> I think I placed it somewhere now I have to find it for this journal as well with same uh, same paper clips so these are my two journals which I don't know how to call them mm. I really don't know how to call them but they are for finishing up so this is my sharing for today I hope you found some uh, some inspiration thank you so so much for all your amazing comments about these paper clips and uh, you know about uh, that template I'm so happy that you like it uh, I hope you will you will enjoy it to make those paper clips because I really love how it looks like and this one as well and I do have somewhere also yeah here I used Tim Holtz stamp uh, I stamped first that butterfly then fussy cut out and I glue it on one side of that <coughs> of the template and now I do have really beautiful holder for tacks so just slide it around and if I will use some ephemera and slide it behind I think it will look amazing so use your stamps and stencils and ephemeras and dies and go to be creative because it's so relaxing so thank you so much for watching thank you so much for visiting me today have a beautiful day take care about yourself and I will see you soon bye